Minister of National Security, the Honorable Dr. Bernard Nottage, applauded the Ministry of Foreign Affairs for its success in human trafficking. He cited the recent report released by the U.S. State Department on Human Trafficking, which ranked the Bahamas as Tier 1. Minister Nottage said not only is this the highest rank a country can attain, but it is the first time the Bahamas has acquired that rank and is the only country in the region to do so. Trafficking in persons associated with the Bahamas at this particular time is sexual and labor. The main indicators of its presence include withholding of documents of victims, such as passports and work permits, withholding wages, working long hours, living with multiple persons in overcrowded and unsanitary conditions, persons being held against their will, and employment in jobs such as exotic dancing. The Trafficking in Persons Interministry Commission Committee and the National Task Force have been established to give focused attention to ensuring that the Trafficking in Persons Act and the government's policies, protocols and programs are implemented. Dr. Nodges listed the statistics of the most recent human trafficking cases, noting that the Department of Immigration continues to address the issue. One trafficker was successfully prosecuted. Two were sentenced from previous convictions and three new prosecutions were initiated. Victim assistance was provided to 17 potential victims of trafficking, seven of whom were adult males suspected of being victims of labor trafficking and nine adult females who were identified as victims of sex trafficking. Although to date no victims of labor trafficking have been identified or rather have been prosecuted based on the TIP indicators, it is accepted that some amount of labor trafficking does take place. 